total shoulder versus reverse shoulder. What's the difference? What does it look like on x-ray? I'm going to show you the difference on x-ray. This is a total shoulder. This is a reverse shoulder replacement. The difference is, and if you look carefully, this replaces the humeral head, this component, and it connects to the humeral shaft by this prosthesis, whereas a reverse, the head gets placed into the glenoid, which is the cup of the shoulder, and then the glenoid gets replaced onto the shaft. That's why it's called reverse. The indications for a reverse shoulder replacement would be somebody that has arthritis with a missing rotator cuff. A total shoulder replacement is done with someone who has a rotator cuff but has arthritis of their shoulder. Reverse total shoulder replacements can also be done in patients who have really bad comminuted proximal humerus fractures. Sometimes total shoulders are done for that, but more often you will see a reverse done for a bad proximal humerus fracture. So indications for a total shoulder is an intact rotator cuff. Indications for a reverse shoulder replacement would be someone who is missing or has a torn rotator cuff.